Hi guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel Tech Chat. In this video, I'm going to talk about how to find out the DNS record of a specific domain. So what I'm going to teach this. If you are an IT uh, guy working in IT industry, so you have experienced this kind of situation. You have to find out the uh, DNS record of a specific domain for some cases. So this video will be very helpful for you. So please watch carefully this video. So to find out the uh, DNS record of of any is any domain over the internet. So you can use MX Toolbox. So open your browser first, then search for MX Toolbox and press enter. Now Google will be suggested the few sites and you can see the first one. This is for mxtoolbox.com. So please click on that. Okay. Now we are on the MX Toolbox. So here you can see we have several options with mx toolbox we can search for the dns record we can do the uh, email health we can check blacklisted uh, things so this is very helpful so guys now we are going to search for the uh, dns uh, records of uh, uh, domain name so today i select youtube.com for this so i will add domain name as youtube.com here so now on my screen you can see this is automatically selected mx lookup so let's see what is the mx record of youtube.com click on mx lookup guys now you can see the mx record of youtube.com so you can see the preference value host name ip address and ttl so these are the major parts of a DNS record. So I talk about these things in previous video and the type of DNS uh, records. So please go and watch that video. So you will understand what is preference value, what is hostname, what is IP address, what is TTL. So I talk about those things. So now you can see uh, the, uh, there is two records, but the hostname is smtp.google.com for both records. But IP address, the value is difference because this is an IPv4 address. So this one is IPv6 address. So that's why there are two records for same, uh, so for same email server with same preference values. So it means that the receiver email server of youtube.com is smtp.google.com. If we send an email, let's say there is a user at youtube.com, administrate at youtube.com. If we send a mail to administrate at youtube.com, the emails will be delivered to smtp.google.com over the internet. So let's see how to find out the A record. So it's, we call it DNS lookup. So click on DNS lookup. Okay, this is the uh, A record of the YouTube.com. And uh, there is one thing to mention you. Remember that YouTube is a large company and there is not only one A record. So sometimes you can have uh, a different uh, result for YouTube.com. So this is changed time to time. Okay, so now we got the result. The IP address is 142.250.81.206. So this is the A record of YouTube.com. Simply A record says the IP address of a domain name. So IP address of YouTube.com is now 142.250.81.206. So now we are going to find up in uh, find out the uh, what we are going to find out the Okay, AAA lookup. So this gives the relevant IPv6 address of YouTube.com. Click on lookup. Okay, guys, you can see that IPv6 address of the YouTube.com. Here, I, 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 I got YouTube.com as domain name because I need to show you uh, how records are available for YouTube.com. So remember that if there is any domain over the internet, you can find the uh, relevant result, DNS result. So this is only for example. So let's say there is a domain techchat.lk. So you can find out the result for techchat.lk. If there is a domain, uh, let's say digitalocean.com. So you can find out the result for digitalocean.com. You can find out a result, mx result, and tx result, and spa record. Spa record also. So okay. Now let's see for the spa record. Okay, click on spa record lookup, and click on spa record lookup again. Okay, now you can see the SPA record. So I have token. To, I have talked about the SPA record. So now you can see we SPF one include Google.com MX. So this is the actually only Google can send mail for the uh, YouTube.com. 
okay now we are going to look okay uh, we have many more options so we can check for blacklist also so if you click on blacklist check you can find out whether this domain is blacklisted or not so this will be helpful so there is some uh, here the uh, mx toolbox will check with some major uh, blacklist uh, db providers so then uh, they, they will show the result so you can uh, find out the result from here okay so if you if you are unable to send email from your domain so it may be due to blacklisted your domain so in that kind of situation you can come to mx toolbox and uh, search for the blacklist check for your domain okay now I will uh, search for let's say I need to find out the a record let's say I need to find out the record of digitalocean.com simply I need to find out the public IP address of digitalocean.com DNS lookup okay now you can see that the a records of digitalocean.com okay so as well as guys you can find out for the uh okay dns check the dns checks means that the uh, you can find out the name saver record of digitalocean.com click on that and click on dns check okay so you can see that type is ns so it means that this is the uh, the uh, name save record ns record so you can see the result so guys i'm not going to uh, explain what is mean by type what is mean by domain name what is mean by type ip address or, and what is mean by ttl here so i talk about that those things in previous video please go and watch that video i need to uh, check um okay youtube.com i need to check out uh, name save record for youtube.com okay so you can see there are four records for this so guys this is how you can check uh, dns records for any domain using mx toolbox so please subscribe my youtube channel and also share this video with your brain and don't forget to follow my facebook page and there is a website for you techchat.lk so there are some troubleshooting videos and also some uh, tutorials for you please go and watch those uh, tutorials and videos so guys thank you very much for watching this video